hello everyone welcome back to the channel once again in this video we're going to fix the uh, clicking issue if your mouse has mine has so i'm going to fix it so you can hear the noise the right one is working fine but the left one is dead you can hear the noise it is making but this one is not so this is uh, the thing and this is the probability that the copper plate is damaged i have done this kind of thing so many times so it's not a thing for me but yeah first you need to disassemble this and uh, unscrew whatever the uh, screws are in there in my case this is just single one handled with one screw so yeah here we are over the circuit you can see all the things the component and so on you can see the uh, uh, right one is with the uh, uh, white lid and the left one is with this red because i have replaced it many times but yeah after a year it is damaged again so yeah i won't be bothered to you know change it over and over again so you need to pull it out don't uh, you know use any kind of pad just use your nails and open it wisely because you don't want to break it off because you need to place it back once you have replaced this copper plate so this is how it looks like it might not be that so much clear because my camera is not focusing that well but you can see this is how it looks like so yeah if you don't have any experience just get it done from someone who has the you know courage to change it or replace it because you might you know break it off or get it damaged so yeah this is the thing we need to change and uh, we just need to open it wisely because this is quite thin and sharpie it might cut your skin so use something a pointy or anything which could you know just remove it so if it's completely dead you don't bother to get it damaged just remove it okay so it is removed now and what we have to do we have to replace it with the uh, new copper plate and how can you get that so once uh, you have uh, this uh, thing removed uh, make sure you have the other replacement how can you get that you have to get it from any other mouse which is dead which is not functioning so yeah that's the thing so i already have so many mouses in my house so i have you know bunch of copper plates but uh, i'm just going to show you how to you know get it used from something like damage this is one of them this is a wired mouse and you can hear the noise both sides are working both sides are making noise both are clicky and i'm just going to use this one and i don't care if it breaks off the plastic lid only so i'm just going to use the plier to remove the plastic lid from the above and i'm just going to remove it and yes here we have its copper plate and we need to place it back if you don't know like how to place it this is way too tiny and you really need some things like your screwdriver a tweezer plier and so on so i would recommend you take your time and just place it if you can't see this i have uh, got this video from internet and uh, there is a user who has uploaded it you can see uh, you can have a close look how he changed it first he pulled it back and then from the front side and then he pressed in the middle so it get fixed so the same thing we have to do with our mouse as well i'm just going to place it from the back side then a little bit of pressure from the front and after that once i get the position done i will align it with the pressure from the middle area okay and i think this is getting placed okay so now i have to push the pressure from the middle so that it get fixed with that uh, with a little bit of pressure okay so yes it is fixed once it is fixed you can hear the noise like it is fixed and then you can see it here you, if you have a close look you can see this is uh, fixed okay so this is now good and we can put our plastic lid back so that you know it's now functional i'm quite sure this is going to work for sure because i have replaced it so many times so yeah okay so now let's place it back so if you have you know spare parts just keep the uh, you know a collection of it you don't know how many times it can be get used so yeah so it's done so now we have to assemble it back i'm in the cover so yeah make sure everything is fixed from your side okay so now let's test it out i'm assembling it back just uh, one screw and 
and it's done. Let's see how it works now. You can hear the noise? This one got too. Okay, so both of the sides are now functional as according to the sound. So now let's test it out on the screen. Okay, here we have this laptop. Okay, now let's make the first right click. Here. Yeah, you can hear the noise. And after that, if I refresh, yeah, there you go. It's working now. Again. Yes, you can hear the proper noises. You can see both the sides are working, left side, right side, and so on. So this is the way I used to, you know, fix this issue with this mouse. Not just with this mouse. Every mouse have this common copper plate, so you can replace it. But make sure you have keep the collection of uh, copper plates using the older or the dead mouses. Don't throw it out. It might help you in upcoming days with your current mouse. So yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you like this video. There's another video that I done a while ago, a long ago. So you can watch that too. Thanks for watching.